Good morning. Today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, uh, June 28th, and I am currently just going through my planner. That's what I like to do in the mornings. I like to go through my planner and see what I need to do. Today I'm getting ready for a shoot that I have tomorrow. I'm kind of just planning like what I need to do, like bring and stuff like that. I have pimple cream on my face because I have two um, pimples that I'm trying to get rid of by tomorrow. So... Um, yeah, I just do my hair y'all but anyways the brand sent me an outfit picture So basically like what I'm gonna be wearing tomorrow, which is nice. I've never I've only done a few shoots with a brand and on those shoots They never I never knew what I was gonna wear But I love that I know what I'm gonna wear because it's easier to like accessorize and stuff like that so I do have to bring like jewelry and uh, my shoes and so yeah, I'm gonna it's gonna be a lot easier knowing what the outfit is gonna be so it's a little bit later I'm getting ready to go hiking. We're gonna finally go hiking. I actually looked at the weather and I was like, wait a minute, it's 70, like 77 today for the high, which is great. I'm gonna do some sunscreen, this one here. This does leave a white cast, but honestly, like, but it's not as bad as some other mineral sunscreens. I personally, um, I've said this before, but I like using mineral sunscreens because my skin is a little bit more sensitive and mineral sunscreens are better for acne prone skin. So unfortunately, most of the time I do have to deal with a slight bit of a white cast, but honestly, I feel like this one's not too bad. Like if I really take my time and work it into my skin, it becomes pretty translucent. Um, and then usually most days I'll just put a powder over it so that way the white cast isn't as obvious and I feel like it looks perfect so like when I really work it in I feel like you don't really see the cast as much I don't know maybe you still see it so I'm taking I'm taking some KVD powder and I'm just gonna put that Ooh. what does this powder look this powder for the center of my face um, water, uh, spray my hair, I'm going to brush it. I don't know what to do with my hair y'all like I really I was on I was on um, Instagram about to book a hair appointment and then I changed my mind like I don't know what to do I kind of want to get I wanted to braids for the summer I wanted to get braids but then again I was like I don't know if I feel like sitting down for all these damn hours <laughs> at the same time it's just so much easier when your hair is like already done I need another edge control because I feel like my hair gets used to edge controls and then it no longer is able to be controlled by them. All right, I'm gonna go spray my hair so that it stays and does not move. Um, for my lips, I'm gonna use my Dior oil. I'm not doing much today because I can feel my edges already like lifting. I'm not doing much makeup today. Obviously, we're going hiking. So we're gonna do this um body spray this is where we're gonna go bear mountain state park and these are all the trails that they have in this map we're gonna do a simple one because this is our first time going now obviously we're going with the kids so we're gonna do a really like small trail but they have so many trails here and they have a lot of scenic views which we, i don't know if we're gonna do any of those but yeah, everything looks really nice i cannot wait 
to go. We probably will get something to eat. Maybe we can do a little like picnic table or something. But yeah. This is my outfit, y'all. I'm wearing this black tee from Skims. My leggings are from Aritzia. Socks are from Aloe. And shoes are from Columbia. I showed you guys these boots a couple weeks ago and I'm finally getting to wear them to go hiking. So I'm excited. I want to tie these a little bit tighter because they feel a little loose. Hey y'all, so we're in the car. Well, Clea and I in the car. Callie and Johnny are getting some stuff. Um, so, yeah, we're on our way. I brought a tripod just in case we want to take some selfies. I brought a couple of hats. One for me, one for Clay. Callie has one on already. Minecraft Dungeon and this is Mario Kart Deluxe A. And also, Minecraft Dungeons can play with two players, so I'm going to play with Clay. Hiking shoes. <laughs> to hike. A little cooler, you know the cooler? Yeah. yeah. They have some on Target on sale. They're like as tall as your your finger. They're like they're as tall as your finger. That's how big tadpoles are in Minecraft. Oh. So we are just leaving the park. We've been here for an hour. It's great. We had a great time. So I'm back home and I'm just going through my list for tomorrow because, um, yeah, so I have the shoot that I told you guys about. So I have my call time. It's 1.30. So I'm going to leave my house by 12. And then I have my hair that I'm going to do. Middle part, bun, whatever. Makeup. These are some things that I don't want to forget. So my Charlotte Tilbury spray, my Urban Decay powder for like touching up like blood and powder and then i wanted to have flash i kind of wanted to remember that but um i do have some you know that's not my entire routine these are just things that i definitely didn't need to not forget oh i need to put blood and sheets on here as well because i don't want to forget those and for skincare i have ice roll shave and sheet mask i want to do all those things probably tonight and tomorrow and then i need a bunch of water <laughs> just to be hydrated and to like get rid of any excess salt and bloating so i'm gonna go ahead and start that right now um i need to pack some shoes so i have the ray heels the new ones that i just got that's one idea but i'm not sure if that's what i i'll, I'll probably bring another pair just in case um then my ysl bag sunglasses i need to put on some arm candy rings hoops fragrance just to make me feel confident and body oil to be a glowing goddess so these are my list for t that's my list so far um i still have things to add to this but um yeah i also want to show you guys some shoes no matter myself i need to go take a shower um i got some shoes from dolce vita they were kind enough to send me these and they look so pretty i'll show you guys them i did pick these out but i just thought they were so pretty mm -hmm, they are pretty mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then, yeah these this is what they look like oh my god these are so cute y'all shiny shiny super shiny Oh my gosh, yeah. Look how pretty. I picked these out because I thought they would be perfect for like dinner in August. Johnny and I are celebrating our 10 year anniversary, so I'm looking forward like different Wait, outfits. you've been married for 10 years. In August. So you've been married for 10 years. Mm hmm. What was the year I was born? Eight years ago. So you're saying. I was born two years after you were married. Yes. Alright y'all, so I'm looking for different um, like shoes now and like different things to wear. So I thought these would be really cute. Um, just really pretty. 
so I need to find an, a bag to go with these and I have one in mind but hopefully I can find it in stock because I think these are just the cutest things ever I don't usually wear silver either but I think that for this shoe I will wear silver because it's just that stunning so. beautiful I'm about to pour myself some water. Water! <laughs> water! Guys, did you know water is bad for you? What? Girl, you just talking nonsense. If you eat it, you might get hurt. I'm doing liquid IV, of course, to get extra hydration. Mommy, why do you always want to get hydrated? Hydration is bad for you. Look at that. What? I think I watched, I think I watched Bad Chase. <laughs> but hydration is bad for you. Who told you that nonsense? Who told you that? Johnny. Johnny? He also left. I'm about to go to the drugstore real quick because I started packing my stuff and realized that I don't have my gel. My heart of gel is missing, so I'm going to go grab that at the store hopefully they have it because they don't always have it this is the only gel that really keeps my hair this is the only gel that keeps my hair like in place quick cvs haul i'm back home i got hey, some it. got some clips You're gonna get, us both in trouble. get some gel elastics got some breath mints because <laughs> hello i'm gonna be in people's face um i got some peach slices for this is like pimple patching. I've never tried this brand, but this is what they had. So I'm going to try it tonight for my one pimple that's not going away. It's just chilling. And then I picked this up because I was like, you know what? Maybe I should try it. I don't know why, y'all. It's like $20. So I was like, this better work because it was literally $20. So I'm going to try it out tonight. It's late. It's like, I don't even know what time it is, but I'm going to try to figure some stuff out. <laughs> so... I'm gonna put y'all over here. I need to try to figure out my life. Um, all right, so I need to shave my face. So I'm gonna do that right now. And then once I'm done shaving my face, I'm gonna put on those pimple. I'll just lay it in this trash. Okay, I think this is better. All right, so I need to shave my face, so I'm gonna put some oil on it to just help, to help the razor glide on better. Um, otherwise, it's just not, it's easier to cut yourself. I learned that the hard way. So I put oil. This one is from Pharmacy. I don't mess around with too many oils. Um, this is one of the ones, this is one of the only ones that I use. For this shoot, I'm actually doing my own makeup and hair, which I personally, um, I really like that because, I really like that because it's going to look exactly how I like it to look, but I'm also nervous because I never did that before. Anyways, let us shave. <laughs> let us shave.
Okay, step one, face is shaved. It looks great, so much better. Um, I'm gonna move on to step two, which is pimple patch. So we're gonna put this guy on so that we can have so we can have our pimple hopefully hopefully this pimple right here that's like little um sharp things it's like um pricking the pimple this one here also i wasn't gonna worry about it but i think i'm gonna put one on here now for the fun part we are gonna try this out full scara I gotta read instructions, which is not my favorite thing to do, but we gotta read instructions for this because we do not wanna mess up. Do y'all wanna see my hair? The rose. Okay, so we don't wanna mess this up. And I'm nervous because I never did this before. <sighs> okay. Step one is to brush on the bone. First of all, <laughs> my eyesight. <laughs> My eyesight is not the best at nighttime, y'all. My eyesight is mid at nighttime, y'all. It's mid. Okay, so this is what the kit looks like. It looks really good. We're excited. This is all the instructions in case you want to read that. I'm just going to go off the box. I feel like the box should be enough. You know? Let me read this because this is too close to my eyes to be playing games. All right. Now, it's the same thing. It's just in 100 million different languages. Yeah, it's the same instruction. A little goes a long way. Wisp under lashes. Use applicator to pluck a wisp. I'm, oh, I was about to say pluck a what? <laughs> yes, I need to go to the eye doctor. Don't judge me. Dab on a thin coat of seal under um, under wisp. This is the final touch. Eliminates any sticky residue and holds wisp in place step four is optional that's to like apply the other thing the overnighter which i don't have say a little prayer for me y'all say a prayer because i don't know what i'm getting myself into right now all right this is the bond so taking taking the bond i don't know why i just know that but i did <laughs> okay Close that up. So we're gonna start applying lashes. Oh shit! I can't see. Yo, the lash fell. Oh, I fell on the table. Yo, this is not. I don't think this is a good idea. Time for the other eye. This should be, this should go smoother, but <laughs> let's see. All right, so I just finished. I feel like it looks pretty good. So I'm happy I did that. And that cuts down my makeup time by like a few minutes tomorrow and um yeah let's see how long this lasts because these look pretty good and i'm gonna get better as i go i have black stuff on my finger on my eyelid i need to clean my eyelids but um i think it looks good if i don't say so myself it's wednesday i just woke up actually i've been up for about an hour or so it's like 6 30 in the morning y'all i don't know why i woke up at 5 30 and i could not fall back asleep so hello <laughs> um i've just been kind of like scrolling on youtube watching videos i actually need to pray i'm gonna do that oh my gosh i just realized my lip balm is still on from last night morning to summer friday is the bomb and um my skin looks great i did my nighttime skin routine the lashes look really good i'm gonna just get myself some water because i have a liquid iv because i want to i want to keep being hydrated y'all 
I still need to pack my bag that I'm gonna bring. I still need to pack, I didn't do that yet, but my call time is at 1.30 today, so I have time. I need to figure out like what makeup look I'm doing. Probably something bronzy in summer, summery. Probably just a bronzy look with a nude lip. It's probably like the safest thing that I can do, so that's what I'm probably gonna do for makeup. And I need to eye roll my face. 9.53, so like 10 o'clock. I'm about to start doing my hair. Actually, no, I'm gonna ice roll first and then I'm gonna start doing my hair because it's basically time to get ready. I wanna start my hair at 10, so 10 to 10.30. And then um, I'm probably gonna do some of my makeup. I might even do some of it on the way there. Um, I'm gonna do like my brows, my eyes. Um, those are the main things I'm gonna do first. And then as it gets closer to as it gets closer to 1 30 as it gets closer to like one o'clock then i'll do the rest of my makeup so i'll probably start the rest of my makeup around 12. that way it'll still be fresh for the shoot because i don't want to do it too early and then it'll just get in stale you know so it's kind of tricky um i'm trying to think yesterday callie was like oh we should go to a hotel and i'm like you know what we should have but when i think about it though hotel check-in time is at Four, three, four. It still wouldn't even work out unless we went to the hotel yesterday, which would have been like a waste, kind of. Cause like I don't know. Anyways, this is so cold, y'all. I really want to get right here, like a little puffy. I'm to ice, ice this pimple down a bit. Well, can you guys hear the birds outside? So I'm watching YouTube, so um, y'all yeah, I'm watching YouTube, my laptop, my laptop is right under the camera, I'm watching YouTube right now, so I'm probably gonna just film the next, I'm gonna do a quick, um, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a time lapse of me doing my hair, but um, I'll show you guys the products I'm using, I guess, I don't know what to watch, because I already watched, um, I think I watched everyone that I wanted to.
All right, so I did my hair. I'm about to start some makeup. I already sprayed my face with the Charlotte Tilbury spray right here. So now, okay, it's like 80, almost 90 degrees today. So I need to figure out like what I'm doing. So I'm gonna do some color correcting. Hmm, should I do that? Yeah, I'm gonna do this next. So I'm just gonna color correct. My pimple is just insisting on being a part of today's show. I don't even know what to say. It's so it's so annoying. <laughs> um, I don't know, y'all. It's just been really annoying. I don't understand why. Okay, I'm just gonna blend it in. Everything is just so much smoother when you shave your face. Okay, y'all, so next we're gonna do a little bit of the Vanessa Myricks Balm. So, okay, next we're gonna use this. My hand is actually. Next, we're gonna use some of this for like primer. I don't wanna do too much. Um, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take my sponge. And I don't wanna do too much of this because I am going to go with foundation and concealer, so I'm just going to put it on the areas that get oily. So, right here. So, yeah, I still have a lot. I still have a good amount of time, so I'm going to put some here. I'm not going to put it on my nose because my nose like breaks up so easily, I don't want to put excess product there. I'm just gonna reserve that area for concealer. Okay, so that's that. Hopefully that should help, that should help with the oils in those areas. And then next I'm gonna do some setting spray. <laughs> next I'm gonna do some more setting spray. So I need to do foundation, concealer, all my powders, like all my face makeup, I need to do that. But I don't want to do it too early, like I mentioned earlier, so I'm going to do it in the car. I definitely do not want to mess up. I don't want to do it too early. I'm just going to take my sponge and everything on my makeup and we're going to do everything else in the car because I don't want to ruin it. I'm going to leave my head scarf on. Let me make sure. I need to shave my armpits. Okay. Let me make sure my hair looks good. Yes. I'm wearing some big hoops. I'm wearing some hoops with this hairstyle because I feel like it's a hoop hairstyle. Every hairstyle is a hoop hairstyle, but definitely this one. For sure. So I'm gonna put this back. I just wanna make sure it was looking good. I don't know why it wasn't, but I just wanna make sure. Ugh. All right, so I'm gonna pack. I need to actually get my kids ready because if they're gonna hang out at Central Park with Johnny today, which is fun. Um, I'm gonna pack some like activities and stuff they can do, like their games, books, a whole lot of stuff. I think I'm gonna bring this powder just in case I need it. 
and that should be good. I think that should be good. I'm gonna pack my makeup bag. Don't forget. <laughs> So I'm on my smaller camera because <laughs> the light in here is horrible. The lighting in here is crazy, but I look good for y'all. Anyways, did my makeup in the car. I need to switch up my earrings. Um, yeah, I'm excited. It's on the 22nd floor, so I'm going to Industrial Color in New York City. Okay. So this is my outfit that I'm going to be wearing. This is the top and the bottom Let's see. I'm gonna go back to the oh, okay it's also so pretty out here guys They heard us. <laughs> Tell them what you did today. Uh, we went to. Can we get something from Barnes and Nobles? Ooh, Barnes and Nobles. Barnes and Nobles. And We're gonna go to the Cheesecake Factory for dinner. 
up to a little bit later. o'clock 10 10 i am getting ready to take off my makeup my makeup lasted all day which is great i do have some sunglasses marks because i was wearing sunglasses for one of the shoots like one of the looks um but yeah i had a great day it was a great shoot it was definitely the best um experience i've had with a brand like on a shoot i haven't done many of these but this was definitely like i think the best one i did yeah it was really like chill and it just went really well everyone was like really um easy going yeah loved it so having a poppy and uh, this is like prebiotic drink it's actually not too bad it's a prebiotic um soda if you will it's not too bad it tastes pretty good but it will send you to the bathroom sometimes <laughs> so beware if you drink it I'm going to use makeup removal wipes to start taking off my makeup. Actually, I need to take off my jewelry. I'm going to take off my jewelry. So, I cannot, I cannot, I can't wait to see the pictures when they send them to us because they're going to send us the pictures that we took with the photographer. We, we had two different, well, three different photographers. One was um, for like the main shoot we did with all the girls. And I'll put a picture of that here because I have like a little screenshot of that. Um, but that's going to be like a big spread. That's going to be a big spread for an American company. And the photographer who short, <laughs> the photographer who shot that, I believe his name is Brian Watt. I can't remember but he is actually Naomi Watts brother um so yeah he was really cool then we had another photographer for outside we had a different photographer for outside and he was really good as well and I also looked at his other I also looked at his work in general and he has some really good photography work so yeah everyone was really nice it was a great experience Oh my gosh. So tomorrow is my last day going into my LPN job. Which is crazy. Crazy. Um, it's going to be in my next vlog. Not in this vlog. Because I'm going to end this vlog tonight. Just because I feel like... I'm probably going to have... Did I just take off the earring back? I think I did. I need to edit this vlog so I can get it up for you guys. I want to get this vlog up. ASAP. Hopefully tomorrow. That might be pushing it. That might be like really pushing it. But I'm gonna try to get it up by tomorrow. I feel like I have a lot of footage in this vlog. I feel like this is gonna be a long vlog. Because I've been vlogging since I've been vlogging a lot since yesterday. One of the other content creators did get some behind the scenes of me. So I'm excited to look at that footage that she shot. I'm also happy I did this. I'm happy I did these lashes because I feel like they came in clutch. showed you guys the beginning of me applying my makeup the main thing that i did was use to zunessa myricks y'all i forgot to bring my um, charlotte silbury setting spray so i was 
I was kind of freaking out because that setting spray is like clutch for me. It's my holy grail. I know like it makes my makeup last all day. Um, and I forgot it. So I had sprayed it on before I did my foundation, before I left the house. But you guys know I did my makeup in the car and I was going to spray it on after I did my makeup. Forgot it at home so I couldn't spray my face. So I had no setting spray. Just like... Mommy? Yeah. 